Hi there. So in this video, we will see how to use assertion in Node.js. So make sure that you have Node.js installed. Type in node in your command prompt, hit enter, and you will find REPL response back. So type in dot exit to exit from this REPL. And now open text editor, save the file with name sample.js and now you can follow along first thing type in variable name assert then call for require assert next thing create one function so that we can test something so i'm going to use function add takes two arguments and it returns a plus b where expected is one variable where we will call for addition of let's say one and three okay now we are going to check assertion with method assert check what's the expected value which is let's say four then we will type the message one plus three equals to four okay so we are going to see the message here so type in node name of your file and execute it will return nothing because our test passes so what if i write five instead of four then test will fail and it will throw this message okay you find assertion error and with message one plus three equals to four okay there are many other methods that allow you to do the same okay for example you can use assert dot okay and execute positive test then execute the code and you'll find no error again if you do negative and it will pass the test with error message assertion error so in order to bring those assertion error you have to pass the negative okay now there is another method called assert dot equal that doesn't expect you to use equals to sign all you have to do is simply give period and then you use number and then execute again okay we are passing positive so it will pass then we pass negative and it will show assertion error okay let's execute again and you'll find assertion error again now there is another method for negative testing which is not equal which also requires to pass positive to get positive okay and in case of not equal however if you pass positive then it will return assertion error if you pass negative then it will return with blank prompt okay so these are some of the assertion method that you can use during your node.js unit testing so this was a short video on some of the methods for assertion that you can use in your node.js assertion testing